All right guys, this is another emergency video, you might call it, having to do with a Windows 10 exploit that was discovered and how you absolutely need to update Windows right now. This is what I might consider a mega exploit and it was actually announced by the NSA as being discovered and delivered to Microsoft so they could patch it. Now, the reason this is kind of a big deal, you might have already guessed, is if you're not familiar with how the like, government works and security agencies in particular, they don't just give out their secrets. They like to collect exploits, they like to be able to use them on for spying, that sort of thing. If they found a exploit that is so bad that they had to actually felt that they needed to give it to Microsoft to patch on all Windows 10 devices, it is a huge deal. Now, fortunately, Microsoft did release a patch. And forgive me, this video is actually a little bit late. This patch was actually released on Tuesday, but it's still worth making because a lot of you might have other devices around your home that you have not updated yet, like maybe a laptop that you haven't used in a week. You need to update it now. You need to go to your computer, either go to the shutdown button and see if it says update and shutdown, or go to the settings menu for updates, the update uh, menu, and click update now. Because here's the thing, if you have a laptop that you're not using or whatever, the next time you go to use it, you're not gonna think, oh, you know what the first thing I should do is? wait for it to update instead of doing it for the thing you went to use it for. Or even if you're watching this at work, set a reminder on your phone so as soon as you get home, you'll remember to update. And there are several reasons why this is pretty urgent. First of all, like I said, this is unprecedented. As far as I'm aware, the NSA or maybe even any other security agency has never publicly announced an exploit they found to give to Microsoft. They might have done it in the past for like little ones in private, but net, nothing this major. And it suggests to me, possibly, this is my opinion, that if they're doing this, it might mean that they know that other government agencies around the world also know about this exploit and have either already begun exploiting it or they're about to find out and that it is literally a matter of national security. That's one of the few reasons I think they would do this is because they felt there was an actual urgent need to release this publicly. And undoubtedly, attackers and hackers around the world have probably been developing tools to take advantage of this exploit for people possibly like you who have not updated yet. And interestingly, the NSA actually made a tweet on their official Twitter account uh, posting information about this exploit. And without getting into too much detail, it basically has to do with Windows cryptographic function, so encryption basically, which is incredibly important in all aspects of computers. Some interesting quotes about this exploit from the document is that it says, allows attackers to defeat trusted network connections and deliver executable code while appearing as legitimately trusted entities. And this includes HTTPS connections, signed files and emails, and signed executables. So really anything that requires trusted certificates, which is basically everything, could be exploited. So the hacker could literally completely take over your computer potentially. And this is another really important point. They say that attackers will understand the underlying flaw quickly and remote exploitation tools will likely be made quickly and widely available. Basically saying you need to patch this immediately because hackers and enemy government security agencies around the world are going to immediately know the implications of this exploit and be able to take advantage of it and will start to take advantage of it. And another really important reason to do it now and not later is because they could use this exploit to install malicious software on your computer that will possibly persist even after you patch it. So kind of once they're in, you can't kick them out again easily. So you need to do this right now immediately. Another thing worth mentioning quickly is Xbox One also runs off Windows 10, a version of it at least. So I haven't read anything saying you need to update your Xbox and that it is vulnerable, but in my opinion, just to be safe, you should probably make sure that your Xbox is also up to date. So to be 100% clear, the patch has been released by Microsoft, is available, and if you run automatic updates or you have updated since Tuesday, you are safe from this exploit, but if you've not done that on all of your computers, you need to do that right now. Now, so that's the main point of the video I just wanted to talk about. As a side note, I'm gonna also be talking about on Saturday how if you're still using Windows 7, you need to update that to Windows 10 now. It has reached its end of life, so Windows 7 is no longer secure. So stay tuned for that video on Saturday, but just be aware that if you're using Windows 7, you need to update, and it's kind of ironic that uh, as I'm talking about this, 
there was a major exploit for Windows 10 released, but still, you gotta do it anyway. So anyway, if you have updated and you guys wanna keep watching, another video I recommend is about my CES coverage, Consumer Electronics Show. I made a quick video going over all the coolest stuff I saw that you might have missed from the Consumer Electronics Show if you don't know anything about it. I'll put that link right here. Usually they're not my most popular videos, but I still like making them, so I highly recommend watching that.